Hey everybody! If you haven't guessed it yet, today we are doing an unboxing for Geek Fuel. Yay! Geek Fuel. <laughs> Geek nice. Fuel. It's like in 3D. It's coming right at you. So this is June. Um, this is for June 2016. Yep, June's box. So um, yeah, it seems. I don't know. It seems early, doesn't it? Well, no. I guess this, this is like the 20th today. Yeah. 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 So I just got this a couple days ago. We just got around to getting get it open today. Um, and actually, uh, I have a, a referral code for those of you who want to use this, and you can uh, save five bucks. I think that's what it's going to say. Five bucks on my next box, maybe. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> maybe a referral I'll link for. That. Yeah, I'll give it to you later. So, um, so anyway, there's uh, a ton of stuff in these boxes. This box is pretty heavy this month, and it's uh, sounds like there's a lot of little things in there. Uh, you know, last month we had some good stuff. I'm going to just reach back here and see if I can grab. Um, yeah, last month we had the uh, the beer stein beer glass that was pretty cool with geek fuel imprint on the front yep. um we had the game of thrones kind of stuff the uh, the print or the uh, this was actually wrapped around the box it was uh westeros from uh, game of thrones and it was a cool t-shirt Tyrion's uh vineyard and uh all kinds of other stuff and this game which i still haven't downloaded yet <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> the weapon nice. The weaponographist, and I really want to download this, so I'm gonna uh, get on my my uh, Steam account here afterwards and, and load it and see what it looks like. So, but that was that was May. So definitely check out our website. We've got all our unboxings in a single channel. If you go a playlist, you can click on it and watch all of our unboxing videos. If you're just not sure what box to pick, because there are so many different boxes out there, we have now unboxed um, Geek Fuel, Loot Crate. Um, Nerd block, nerd block, comic block, um, fan girl box. We unboxed one time. Um, Bam box. We've unboxed the Bam box. We've unboxed. We've done a lot. A couple other ones. So there have been some really, really good ones. Uh, indie stash just this last weekend, which was cool. If you're just a an indie comic fanatic, you love indie comics. Uh, that's a, a really cool way to get some great indie comics. Um, you know, loot crate's been good. Geek fuel's been good. Um, None of them hit every single time, I would say. Yeah. But but you know, two out of three, you get some great stuff. So, uh, and it all depends on what you're into. Yeah. So, uh, but Geek Fuel is a lot of fun. They they always have a downloadable game, a Steam game that you can download, and it's usually between ten and twenty bucks just for the game. So that's pretty cool. And then uh, on top of that, I, I believe. We always get a T-shirt. This was my first Geek Fuel T-shirt here, the Avengers as Ninja Turtles. Um, I remember that was the first one I opened. The, the And the shirts are good quality. I haven't – I opened a couple of uh, Loot Crate shirts and was just like, ugh, you know, they're real flimsy and kind of soft, and, and they shrink too fast, and I, I don't like that. So I really like the heavier duty, heavy duty shirts, um, and these the shirts from Geek Fuel are always really, really nice. So, cool. all right. So this month – uh, we'll pull out the Geek Fuel magazine. First thing on the cover, TMNT. Uh, something about Pokemon there as well. Uh, June's best games um, for June. So June 2016. Let's see here. what else is in here. Um, for a limited time, Geek Fuel has a rare and elusive offer for another from another world. The oh, Venus wow. flytrap, most feared plant among insects, can be yours absolutely free. And there's a little coupon thing to send in to get a super one-up planting pot seeds. It's cool. Um, all right. So there are some really good articles. There's a top 20 Pokemon. So you can read that article and see if you agree with that. Um, number 20 is Jigglypuff, of course. I, I, I agree. I like Jigglypuff in there. I don't really see any that I, that I don't agree with. So um, there's another cosplay feature. They do a, a good thing every month with uh, picking a cosplayer or several cosplayers and throwing them in there. This is uh, var variable cosplay is the cosplayer of the month. Um, and she's got several different uh, characters that she does. Um, thing about Ninja Turtles, the most radical toys you ever loved. And there's uh, action figures and the different toys, the party wagon, all that stuff. So that's cool. Um, GameRevolution.com is uh, the featured uh, company, so that must be where our Steam game comes from when we get to that. 
um, some different folks on here for their unboxings. Of course, once again, we're not in the interior. Oh, well. Um, Maybe we'll bit evolution. Ultimate Geek Gift Guide. It's always some cool stuff there. Um, and then just people doing unboxings. So, uh, and on the box, on the box, on the box, <laughs> on the back, on the back. <laughs> Bebop and Rocksteady on the back. So, They're on the box, kind of cool. <laughs> All right. So, our game for the month is Bit Evolution, and that's really awesome. It comes in like a an old, um, looks like an old Game Boy cartridge, you mm -hmm. know, the way it's designed. Yeah. Um, Bit Evolution is a journey into the past that draws inspiration from all of your favorite titles from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Travel through video game history with Bit as he transforms from a simple 8-bit eight eight hockey puck. Boy, I'm having trouble speaking today. Okay. 8-bit hockey puck into a mob bopping, platform jumping, pixel collecting, pixel legend. Okay. Uh, along along the way, Bit discovers how to travel back and forth between the real world and the realm of code, a dark foreboding dimension lurking between game levels. Through this realm lay the secrets to accessing new worlds and new adventures, each compiled of memorable bits from video game platformers of the past. That's pretty cool. So you get a Steam key on the back of this cool little thing, and then you can download uh, the game. So that's awesome. I like the games that they give. Um, and it is. it has uh, usually has a retail value on there of it, but it doesn't this time. I'd say it's probably a $10 or $15 game right off. <clears throat> All right. Woohoo. I got... Who's that Pokemon? It's Charizard. I got Charizard. Um, looks like a tattoo. That's a tattoo. Nice. Awesome. I'll wear that to work tomorrow. I'll drop it on the floor too. Yeah. Maybe put Probably. it like high up on your neck. <laughs> I'm gonna put it right here on my cheek, right on my forehead. Um. All right. So there's a little. Okay. There's a little uh, Super Mario Stamper. That's Luigi. I guess I'll turn him right side up. <laughs> Luigi right. Stamper. You know, you can like stamp Luigi all over yourself. A lot of, uh, of self-marking stuff in here this time. Um, you got a little black cylinder. It says Turtle Trainer on top. Uh -oh. And it looks like there's four different turtles that are in here made in China. Good. Um, and it is a Geek Fuel exclusive, so um, I'm guessing there's turtle inside, and it says, which turtle did you tame? And, uh... Oh, you're mean. Okay. There we go. I got the green... Oh, it's a turtle Pokeball! Oh, that's cool. Well, that is pretty cool. Like, soft or hard, or...? It's, it's soft. It's like a... Squishy. It's squishy, and I will call it squishy. It'll be my squishy. All right, so I'll put it back in there. But that's cool. Turtle trainer, you know, it's a combination. Ninja Turtle, Pokemon. Uh, you can have four different colors. You can get the green one. Actually, it looks like blue. What the heck? How did I get green? That's retarded. The, the options on the bottom are blue, red, orange, and purple. But I got a green one. I don't know. Somebody forgot to. Maybe yours is super rare. Probably. It's worth $10 million. I'll put it on eBay in about five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So this is the super one up planting pot to get the. Uh, to, to plant the. Um, um, the Venus flytrap in. So that is really cool. It looks like one of the. Pipes. Joop, 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 joop. Nice. So you've got the shadow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So that's very neat. Um, and it's empty. So you can send away with the coupon inside the book to get the seed to uh, to plant your own Venus flytrap so that it'll be, um, you know, this inside. Pretty cool. It won't really look like that. It'll look like a regular Venus flytrap, but still. It's yeah. pretty neat. So I will put it back in the plastic wrap and back in the styrofoam so that I don't hurt it. That is pretty awesome. 
All right, so what else? Pokemon, Mario Brothers, Ninja Turtles. Um, oh, hey, that's cool. <laughs> that's funny. Um, sorry, <laughs> I'm like laughing and stuff. <laughs> okay, so let's look at the thing. We got the Super Mario. Oh, okay. Well, there, I'm retarded. Sorry, everybody. Um, when you're looking at the at the turtle, even though on the bottom it shows the shell color, you're really looking at this band. So I got the red one, uh, and the other ones are yellow. Does that mean, or does that mean you have like Donatella or Raphael? I guess so. Yeah, yeah. Raphael's in my Pokeball, so I'd be like, Raphael, I choose you. He'd be like, Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> um, yeah, Turtle Trainer Stress Ball. Stressed out from trying to, co to teach a turtle to say cowabunga? Try using our Turtle Trainer Stress Ball to ease your worry. It's super effective. All right. Um, so we got the bit evolution. We got uh, the Super uh, super One-Up Planning Pot. Uh, we got the Pokemon Temporary Tattoo. We got the Super Mario Ink Stamp. There's four different ones. You could get Luigi. You could get um, Donkey Kong, Mario, or um, Yoshi. So that's kind of cool. And then there is a one, a variant, one of 1,000. Um, let's see here. Oh, okay, there's two two different variants. Um, it's Sherlock Manga, A Study in Pink. And it's the, you, you get either this variant cover or there's another variant cover um, that is like a photo variant. And that's the more, of course, the more rare one that I didn't get. Uh, but it does come. Yeah, it, it's a cool cover. Uh, and then it does come with a certificate on the back as well that says this uh, Geek Fuels issues the certificate to authenticate this copy of Sherlock A Study in Pink as an exclusive limited edition distributed solely by Geek Fuel. So, very cool. And I don't know what the distribution rate is on, on Geek Fuel overall, um, so I can't tell you how many of these were, were put out, but it does say the other ones are limited one, you know, of a 1,000. So, that's cool. So, we got something from... Pokemon Ninja Turtles, Sherlock. Um, we got something from, or two things from Mario Brothers. We got another thing from Pokemon. We got the 8 bit revolution. And then we got the t shirt. And the t shirt is just awesome. And I, I love this t shirt. This is so cool. <laughs> you know, it's always some kind of a mashup or some kind of a cute little funny thing. This is Big nice. League Pikachu. Nice. <laughs> that was very cool. He looks like he's got a big old wad of gum in his mouth. Yep. Trainer's Choice. Bubble gum, got to chew them all. That's hilarious. Aww. That's that, awesome. That is cool. I like that. That's a very cool shirt. So that's it. Um, I'll show everything real quick once one more time. Again, uh, the turtle pokeball um, in a cool turtle trainer uh, tube. Pretty cool. Uh, should have been in an ooze canister. That would have been even more awesome. Yeah. Uh, we got uh, a, a bit evolution. We got the Pokemon. Um, Tattoo. Little tattoo, and I guess there were four different, or three different ones, or four different ones you could get. You get Meowth, you could get um, Charizard, Pikachu, or oh, I guess Meowth and a little like a flying Charizard, or the big Charizard with Pokemon above his head, or Pikachu with a Pokeball. So uh, the Sherlock magazine or comic magazine, Sherlock comic, um, the Geek Fuel magazine, and. The super one-up planting pot, as well as a little uh, stamper. So, pretty good stuff. Um, on you know, all of this. This is um, I think it comes out to like twenty-four dollars a month, uh, including shipping, something like that. So it's really not a bad price for all of that kind of stuff. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's so. what you pay for the t-shirt alone, anyway. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a great t-shirt. I, I love the t-shirts. They've lasted. You know, this is my first one that I opened last year in January. And I mean, as many times as it's been washed, you know, the, I mean, they're faded a little bit, but they're still, you can tell, you know, the, the characters and everything. So pretty cool. Very cool. All right. That's uh, Geek Fuel for June of 2016. I hope you guys liked it. Um, be, feel free to ask us questions about anything if you're, uh, if you're interested in them. Um, you know, if you, I'm going to go ahead and put my link in there as well. So you can click through that link and uh, if you want to get signed up. And that's uh, about it. Please like, share, subscribe. We, we enjoy that and appreciate that. Yep. Thanks, everybody. So, Have a good one. All right. Thanks.